Hello there, I'm Paul from Ask the Expert. We have a question about stainless steel today, and that question is, I work with stainless steel and I find many products blew the material due to heat. Do you have any suggestions? Okay, so the reason the stainless steel is blooming is obviously, as you say, is to do with heat. So that warms up the material and you get a blue burning effect on the stainless steel, which is not ideal, doesn't look great, and you're gonna have to rework that. So if you can reduce that blueing that you have on the stainless steel, then that's gonna be an advantage to you. So if you're using uh, a cutting disc to cut your stainless steel, the best thing that you can do is cut quickly. So get through the material as quickly as possible. So to avoid or minimize the blueing on stainless, I can recommend you go with a Quantum uh, 3, which is a fully ceramic abrasive, and that cuts much quicker than a conventional aluminum oxide disc. So you avoid uh, you know, staying inside the cut uh, for too long, therefore creating friction, therefore creating heat. That combined with a powerful angle grinder such as this, nearly a two kilowatt grinder, will get the, uh, the cut done very fast, reducing the chance of uh, burning in the cut. If you're using a coated abrasive to take off uh, small TIG welds on the surface too, it's really simple. What you need to do here is you need to choose a product that has a top size layer applied to the surface of the coated abrasive. We call it here at, uh, at Norton, we call it a super size layer, but it was also refers to as a top size. And that is a special layer we put over the top of the abrasive grains, which acts as a cooling agent when you grind to again, reduce that heat. Easiest way to recognize whether a coated abrasive has a top size, super size layer on the top is just to simply have a look at it. If it's shiny, like this flap disc here, this has not got a top size layer on it. So you can see the shininess of the phenolic resins we use producing uh, products like this. So clearly I can see that's shiny, it's not super sized. If, you, if however you look at the flap disc here, that we have, that's a dull matte finish. That tells me there is the extra layer, uh, the cooling layer applied to this coated abrasive product, and therefore that will be much cooler grinding and taking off the material than uh, one without the top size. So always, with a coated abrasive, always choose the matte sort of finish on there. That'll do a much better job for you. Hope that helps you. Bye-bye.